Hello my sweetie cutie and lovely math lovers. I brought an interesting math for you once again. I found this math online and I found that people solve this math problem so complex way. Interestingly, I solved this mathematical statement three different way which are the simplest one. I would like to say this math problem which is m to the power 9 plus m to the power 6 is equal to 36 and there is only one condition the value of m must be the real number at the final stage let me start with this equation once again m to the power 9 plus m to the power 6 which is equals to 36 and again i should remind you that m value of m will be the real number at the end let me start with this one i can rewrite this m to the power 9 like this way m cube and then whole cube why because cube of m can be multiplied with this cube that means 3 multiplied by 3 is 9 m9 which is exactly the same on here followed by similar way i can rewrite this m to the power 6 as this way m cube and whole square which is equals to m to the power 6 and right hand side is 36 let's consider one thing let us consider m cube is equal to any simplified parameters let's say x why m cube is, is x is considered here because to make it simplified version of this equation so if i replace this m cube by x this equation become x cube plus here x square and i would like to write this 36 like this way 9 multiplied by 4 9 multiplied by 4 is 36 on this mathematical equation i can take a x square common from this part and that part let's take x square common here and remaining is x and here remaining is 1 and one right hand side i want to do a small mathematical engineering what is that engineering i want to rewrite this 9 as 3 square and multiplied by 4 can be rewritten as 3 plus 1 why this is small mathematical engineering on right hand side because look at here this x, x square that means something square on left hand side and something square on right hand side they are equal similar way something plus one left hand side and something plus one right hand side they are equal this mathematical statement we can say there is two possible solution first solution could come out this and that equal that means x plus one left hand side here which is equals to three plus one on right hand side and second possible solution could be x square on left hand side which is equals to three square right so let's solve one by one here x is equal to 3 plus 1 is 4 4 minus 1 is equal to 3 i can again go back to our original parameters which is x is equal to m cube that means i'm replacing this x by m cube which is equals to 3 that means this can be rewritten as like m is equal to third root of 3 this is one possible solution of this mathematical statement that i find but it's not the end we have second possible solution which is given here that means x square is equal to 3 square what does it means i can rewrite here x is equal to plus minus square root of 3 square right and again this square and that square root they cancel each other and remaining is x is equal to plus minus 3 here we have two possible solution x is equal to plus 3 and x is equal to minus 3 let's do it one by one if x is equal to plus 3 i can rewrite this x as a m cube exactly here that means m cube is equal to 3 and again m is equal to third root of 3 this is another solution that is exactly same as the first solution we found that means first solution and second solution exactly the same and third solution if i consider x is equal to negative value of 3 from here and then i can replace this x by m cube is equal to minus 3 that means m is equal to third root of minus 3 here third root of minus 3 what does it means we know square root of any negative number is the imaginary number 
and that doesn't fit with our condition here at the beginning we say is that the value should be the real number that means this is not the solution solution is m is equal to third root of 3 which is solved by first solution and second solution so this is the answer this is so simple right well that is not the simplest solution this is the simplest solution that i am gonna to do now what is that from here i don't need to consider anything else i can directly solve this let us consider a common parameters here m to the power 6 and here m to the power 6 so if i take 1 m to the power 6 from these two parameters this become m to the power 3 plus this become 1 and right hand side is 36 right i want to rewrite this m to the power 6 again that way m cube and then whole square and then here m cube plus 1 which is exactly this one is here and right hand side i can rewrite this way 9 multiplied by 4 again i can rewrite simply this way 9 i can write 3 square and 4 can be rewritten as 3 plus 1 same way something to the power square and something to the power square left hand side and right hand side same and something plus one on left hand side and something plus one on right hand side they were also same so the in this case also we have two possible solution first solution is m cube whole square on left hand side which is equals to three square from right hand side this square and that square from both that side they cancel each other and remaining is m cube which is equals to 3 that means if i write this on m is equal to third root of 3 this is the one simplest solution second possible solution is m cube plus 1 which is equals to 3 plus 1 that means m cube is equal to 3 plus 1 4 4 minus 1 is equal to 3 and it means m is equal to third root of 3 which is also exactly same as the previous solution that means in this case both solutions are same the answer is m is equal to third root of 3 this is the answer for this case see in previously in previous in my previous solution m is equal to third root of 3 in both cases in this case also m is equal to third root of 3 so they are the exactly the same solution this is a pretty long solution and this is the simplest solution i can say